The best time of the year is here. MLB the 24. MLB the MLB the 24. I don't even know what to say. MLB The Show 24 is finally here, man. And there's so many things to do, so many things to grind in this game. And you guys might be asking, Adam, are you gonna be doing No Money Spent again? You damn right I am. You damn right, I got a code from SDS to get this game for free. Thank you, SDS, I appreciate it and I love you. So I am literally gonna be completely No Money Spent. I did get the Digital Deluxe version for Early Access, or they gave me that. So we have 32 packs. We have a collector's edition pack, cover athlete, two or six items, ball player equipment. We have a legend. We have a barrier breaker and a cornerstone pack. So we're going to open all that in this video. I'm also going to be showing you guys the way I'm going to be grinding this day one so you guys can kind of follow along and do exactly what we did last year. Like I said, there's so many things to do. You have all the team affinity to grind for. So. You can grind it. It's also easier to grind this year. Once you get it, you can get all these cards, all 89 overalls. So they're given 30 89 overalls right here. They also have other programs. They have this um, starter program, which is probably the first thing you should do. Just knock this out. It's going to be super, super easy. They have a spring breakout program, which I'll probably... I think I'm going to do it second. I think... I want to knock out the showdowns for Team Affinity first. So we're going to go grind that now. We're going to get a bunch of packs and we're going to have a big pack opening later in this video. So make sure you guys stay along for that. Also, I'm going to be giving away one digital deluxe version, either Xbox or PlayStation, whatever system you guys are on for YouTube. So just down below, just comment anything. If you guys leave a comment, you guys will be entered into that giveaway for a chance to win a digital deluxe version of this game. I will announce the wi the winner in the very next video. So make sure you guys pay attention to that. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, the like button, and hit those notifications so you guys get notified when every video is live. Okay, so the question is, what card do I want first? And I think that's an easy answer. As a Marlin fan, I need my boy. I need my boy Stanton. 76 contact, 110 versus lefties, 92 and 87 power. You know he's gonna have one of the best swings in the game. That man got a swing on him. So let's go straight to, actually let's go, let's go knock out the moments. Let's go knock out all the moments first. Well, that was easy. You guys know, if you guys have been a part of this YouTube channel for a minute, you guys know David Justice or Barry Bonds is one of the best cards in the game. That's my man right there. Justice, justice, don't be caught. Oh my, you know what? First one of the year, to the moon! Yeah, we do to the moons against the CPU. It don't matter. They are really hooking you up with packs, man. You're gonna be getting so many packs no money spent this year. So many packs. Um, I think they kind of changed Stanton's swing. It doesn't feel as good as it did last year. Ah, uh, it's fine. It still kind of feels, I thought it felt a little different, but it felt the same. They made these moments so easy this year. You can already tell as I fail, right on cue. We better score here. We got 39 speed. There's no chances, man, scoring. Thank you. Finally, David Wright on the fourth turn got that done. On to the next moment. That's not an extra base hit. Packs are never fun. That's why. That's literally why I want no money spent. I never get shit from packs. I might as well just do it for free. If I get nothing for packs, at least I'm not expecting to get. Whenever I open up day one, whenever I, I put money in the game, when I used to actually not be no money spent, and I would put five hundred dollars in the packs, my best pull would be like an eighty-seven. I'd be like, that was a waste of my money. I know you guys like to see packs, but I think you guys like to watch no money spent better than packs. Let me know down below in the YouTube comments. Do you guys like to watch big pack openings on YouTube? Or do you guys like to watch that slow, no money spent grind like we're doing? Let me know, man. Let me know. Can I add a damn double? It's just impossible. Finally, Vladdy. There we go. So we knocked out the first four moments and just like that, we have 12,000 XP. I think the next thing I'm gonna do is showdown. I love doing Showdown. I'm so happy it's repeatable as well. So it should be an easy process just repeating these Showdowns over and over again. 
You get, where's Showdown? You get four season one, chapter one vouchers. You get four, okay. You get 30,000 for Conquest though. But man, I cannot do Conquest. I'd rather knock out three Showdowns back to back to back than hop in Conquest. If I don't have to play Conquest, I am not going to play Conquest. Obviously, for anyone who likes to do Conquest, that could be your route, but I'm going with Showdown. I'd do probably Team Infinity, or I'd be doing, um, I'd be grinding the um, Spring Breakers. Look at Stanton, man. Stanton's so good. I'd be grinding this or the Spring Breaker stuff. Okay, David. That's not good. But it feels better than it did last year, and he already had a good swing last year. I love how Stanton 62 speed. My man got some wheels on him. There it is, Nolan Jones. That should win this moment. That was simple. Look at my boy. Look at my boy. Yeah, it might be a change up down the middle. I don't care. They don't add enough legends. Like they really added, if you think about it, they added like nobody this year. You would think they would add way more legends. Okay. I actually hit a home run with Devers. Look at that. But I'm going to definitely be playing it. I might have to make... Oh my. Stantis is going deep every chance he has. Oh, JD. We ain't losing. Oh my god. What is that? Bro, if JD does that this year, that would be awesome. The GOAT. All he does is go deep. All he does... That's why we're getting him first. Get the game on Game Pass and then... Oh my god. Did he do it again? I'm pretty sure he's homered every time. That's not gone. I'm just late. Wait, wait. Oh my God, Charlie Blackman's better than the computer. Barry Bonds, going oppo. Can you imagine if Barry Bonds was actually in this game? It is sad, I was talking about this on Twitch, YouTube, but they really kind of let down with the legends this year. Obviously, Beltray's cool. Uh, the other Negro League legends are awesome. Like getting Joss Gibson, that's a big one right there. He, that card is going to be filthy. Um, Pettit, Bernie Williams, those are some awesome legends. But overall, like compared to last year, it feels like a letdown. And uh, I feel like there's just so many legends they could add. So if there's a legend that you guys want in next year's game, leave a comment down below. Let me know. I'm shocked we did not get A-Rod or e -Rod this year. Shocked. I thought one of them for sure was going to be in this game. Um... Yeah, I'm surprised, but A-Rod's much needed. They're adding all these steroid guys. Why do we not have A-Rod yet? JD Martinez. Look at this no-doubt animation for this man. Is he golfing? What's he doing? There he goes again. Just like that, we won. So it's 20 to 14. We're going to go straight to the boss right now. We're going to beat the boss easy. We're going to get 11K. We're probably just going to keep repeating this because this is simple. Stanton. Another perfect perfect. That's all he does. Carlos Beltran would be one of the best cards in the game if he was in this game. A postseason Carlos Beltran? Oh my god. That's cheese right there. Here he... That's... Oh, did you see the curve on that ball? It looked like it was going to be a line out straight to the left fielder and it actually like curved like a normal ball would. I like that. Justin Turner. Three more runs. Let's go. Ooh, they changed Jose Abreu's swing way better. That was a way better swing than he had last year. Did I just strike out? Max Muncy, one more. Or we're just going to hit one down the line and probably score that way. Yeah, we're going to send him. There it is. So we win our very... There it is. We won our very first showdown. So we're going to get 11,000 stubs or 11,000 XP in these Team Affinity. And I'll show you guys where we're at. So we're going to knock out these three vouchers here. We're going to go get one more, get this voucher done here. And just like that, after just about 20 minutes of grinding the moments and the showdowns, we're already at 23,000 points in this TA. So all we need is 60,000 to get here. So we're basically, what, 40% done? Um, so there's repeatable missions here, right? If you guys get 15,000 PXP with Marlin players in, um, you can do online, wherever you do in Diamond Dynasty, you can get 6,000. So this is like a really easy way to grind. Just get Marlin players, 
go in play versus computer and you just get 15,000 PXP. That basically takes like four innings, three innings. Like this really, really easy to grind Team Affinity. So like I said, I think I would first, I would probably do this first, knock out, get a couple diamond players, go into the, um, go into the, <laughs> The spring breakout, knock this out. Just like that, you have a full diamond team, probably in a couple hours. Like this shit really doesn't take too long, but I would do this first as well. I would do this first, cause it's gonna take probably five minutes, I would assume. This is always super, super fast. Start a showdown, moments, knock that out. But yeah, let's, uh, what packs do we have right now? We have 33 packs. I kinda wanna get 50 and then do a pack opening. So let's keep grinding. I wanna get 50 packs. We're gonna knock it out and end the video right there. I cannot believe this Korea swing. This swing is so damn good. Like the day 99 Korea comes out, he's gonna be just amazing if he has this swing. Then you'll get vouchers and you can put the voucher. Oh my God, Carlos Correa is him. I can't get over how good Correa is gonna be. Well, that should be the end here. We're gonna get another 11,000 subs and let's see where we're at. We're at 34,400. So we're a little bit more than halfway to get to this and we only did two showdowns and the moments. That's how easy it is to get the 34,400. I have not done any of this. Like if I was gonna do any of this, I would knock it out so fast. Cause this is 10,000. Like this should not, this would be super fast to do it. I just don't have enough players yet. As soon as I get enough players, knocking this out is gonna be so quick. 20 homers and play versus computer. You go to Costco Field and knock it out in a second. So we've grinded. We've grinded. I've, I've finished Showdown two more times off recording, right? To get the 28%. I have two more vouchers right now. So let's go put those in. <laughs> Obviously, we got to go one by one. <laughs> we got to go one by one. We finished that, which means now we have 62,000 TA points. We're going to get our first NL East boss from the Team Affinity Pack. We're gonna go open up that right now because you guys already know. You guys already know who that's gonna be. We're grinding for Stanton. And the next card we're gonna get is Carlos Correa because his swing is so damn good. But now it's time. I promised you guys a pack opening. First, actually, let's go with the collector's edition. Let's get the bat skin. Bat skin's nice. Let's get these. Uh... It's just nice just because like you can grind the NL East players for the, for the points. Because if you grind like you have a certain amount of NL East players, you can just fly through the team affinity stuff. <laughs> we got the bat skin. Let's get that. We got some. Is this just player items? Oh, it's players. Okay. Wow. I didn't I didn't know that. <laughs> um Buxton. Absolutely one Buxton. I'll open that, that up later though. The legend pack, a lot of you guys are asking me which legend am I going with? I think they're all pretty good. But I'm going Andrew Miller. You cannot beat a guy with 108 hits per nine, 101 Ks per nine, 99 velo, 99 break, and 125 pitching clutch, and a lefty. Yeah, I feel like that's an easy choice for the barriers pack. Um, I think a lot of them good. I think Gibson solid, Jackie Robinson solid, Tony Stone has really really good content. I mean, that's a great card for a 90 overall. This is actually a phenomenal card. Now, am I choosing her? No. This looks like a good card. I think the best card is Tahiga though. Like he's a two-way player, but I think just as a hitter, 76, 79 contact, high 90s power, 81 clutch with the solid early game, 85 fielding, 83 speed. Yeah, you can't beat that. So we're gonna go Tahigo. And now we got 35 packs. I just want one good diamond. I never have good pack luck. Please let me have good pack luck. First pack of the year. Can you imagine we just pulled a massive diamond? That'd be so sick. Okay, a gold second pack ain't bad. That ain't bad. Just let me see a diamond. I know we got a diamond. We have to have good pack luck this year. Oh boy. <laughs> I wonder, let me call our first diamond. Our first diamond of the year is gonna be Ronald Acuna. It's just gonna be, or Tani, or Judge. Well, there's a diamond. <laughs> what is this? Oh, it's just a, we don't care about that. Okay, come on. We need it. We got a silver, yeah, expected. We opened up, I think we already opened up 10 packs. I just don't feel too good. It's just the no money spent, the no money pack luck, 
It, it, just, it just doesn't work out for me. All it takes is one, though. Nothing yet, nothing yet. They're just warming up. At least we're actually getting some silvers. Like, obviously, any cards we get early game is going to help us out in the long term to finish collections, because that's the ultimate goal. Obviously, we want that 99 Babe Ruth. But um, we need some diamonds. And we're getting bronzes. Come on, just one diamond pool. One diamond pool, man. I just want to see the diamond back there. We're getting golds. <laughs> we're getting gold. That's still helpful. We have three golds in this, pa in this pack opening so far. Seven packs left, and then we have a gold as a habit pack. Hey, there's my boy. There's my boy. That's actually not a bad opening reliever, to be honest. I know he's a gold, but that's actually not bad. Another gold. That's another reliever who's going to help us out, at least right away. We have five packs left. <laughs> Are they not going to give me... Did I just pull two Tanner Scots? Where's the diamond at? Three packs left. It ain't looking good, fellas. It ain't looking good. My pack luck is back. Yeah, we get the double golds. We don't get a diamond for our first... Oh, I forgot about this. I'm pretty sure... I'm, I'm not going to open this yet. I kind of want to do more research on who I should pull. I think I'm going to get Byron Buxton from that. But yeah, that's going to be the end of the video. Sadly, we don't pull a diamond. I'm not shocked by it. But I hope you guys enjoyed that grind stream. If you guys have any questions about what you should grind first, what you should do, no money spent, leave a comment below. I'll make sure to answer it. Or someone in the YouTube comments, I'm sure, will answer it for you. But I'm so excited. 24, here, 24 is here. If you guys are new, make sure you guys hit that subscribe button. Don't forget to hit the thumbs up. And as always, don't forget to turn on those notifications so you guys can get notified when every single video is live. And until next time, I'll see you guys over in the next one.